Uh, for some, it's inspiring. For others, it's stress. Remember the sights and sounds here in the DMV from a few years ago? Well, another massive cicada invasion is expected to hit parts of the U.S. as early as this month. For the first time in over 200 years, 13-year and 17-year cicadas are reaching adulthood and emerging from the ground at the same time. That's quite a prom dance there. So you got 16 states, mainly in the South and Midwest, that will be swarmed by trillions with a TRI of them. Illinois and Iowa, guess what? They're going to experience both of them. Oh. <laughs> but if you take a close look at this map, parts of Southern Maryland and Eastern Virginia could see and hear some too. Here in the DC region, though, we will not be invaded by cicadas like we were back in 2021. Still, the messaging is the same. Those beady eyed noisy bugs are a nuisance, but they are not a threat to humans or pets. These cicadas uh, don't have mouth parts that can hurt us. Uh, they're sap feeding insects, um, so although they are a um, a nuisance um, uh, as far as noise outside goes. There's no harm uh, they pose directly to you. In fact, some people eat them. Um, that's their own thing. I would say um, just enjoy their emergence because this phenomenon doesn't happen all the time. Topper has had a chocolate covered cicada, but here's the thing. Yeah. You don't want your pets to eat these because nope. that's a problem and you know all about that <sighs> and we don't need to detail it. Just think about the worst thing ever and that's about what happened. Cicadas can damage those small plants and trees, so experts suggest using some netting to protect them. And then after the cicadas emerge, they're going to fly around and scream for about six weeks and then they mate and they lay eggs for the next broods before they die off.